guys, so today I'm going to be doing my One Direction Where We Are Tour bucket list, and I thought this would be pretty cool for my concert series thing, and this is going to be the last one in this series, but I hope you guys really enjoyed this series. If you did, watch the other videos. I'll link all three of them down below if you want to check them out. I did a tips for One Direction concert, what to bring to One Direction concert, and what to wear to One Direction concert, so yeah, this is just going to be my bucket list. Maybe these are things you guys want to do there as well. So yeah, I'm just going to list like five things probably, and then I'll tell you what they are now, I guess, yeah. So, I don't know, I kind of chose five because my concert is on August 5th, and if I go to August 4th also, but I thought five was a good amount, so yeah, let's get started. For one, I want to hear them perform all of the songs on set list because that just will make the whole concert. I mean, that's pretty simple for a bucket list, but like... I don't know, that's kind of just like the whole point of the going to the concert, and I just can't wait to hear all of them like and how they perform all the songs so that's gonna be pretty cool and like to be able to see like what the stage is set up and like the like everything in person like the stage is always pretty cool for the one action concerts so I can't wait to just see how they changed up this year number two I am hoping to meet a lot of you guys at the concert so if you guys are planning to meet me at the August 5th or August 4th concert because I will be at both of them as so far as I know of um, then let me know in the comments down below, and I'm definitely going to be doing a meetup. Um, I don't know if I'll be doing both of the both those days. It depends on my people. I want to get there pretty early so that I can try to meet them, like, at the back or whatnot and stuff like that. Or maybe Five Seconds of Summer, because last time I was at the, their concert, I saw Five Seconds of Summer. Well, I saw Ashton in the back near where they were um, getting out to go into the venue. And I was literally this close to taking pictures. I don't know if you guys remember, but yeah, he was like literally two feet from me because he was taking pictures of people. But by the time I ran there, um, people crowded him and I wasn't able to because they made him go into the venue, which was really sad. But yeah, it would be super cool to meet anyone from Fast and Summer One Direction or if there's any other opening acts, that would be pretty awesome. Number four, to buy my concert merch. I literally, oh my god, I literally survive on concert merch. I have a, a concert shirt from every single concert I've been to ever. Because I just love them so much and I think that they're so cool and they really represent like where you were and like um, the concert that you were at. So I really like keeping those and I, as I said, I have them all from every concert I've ever been to for anyone. So the last thing and number five is I want to like write them a letter before something to be able to like be called on stage or something. Or if that like won't happen because I don't know if they're calling people on stage or not, um, then I would like want them to do my Twitter question. And, I actually haven't like seen like I haven't been on Twitter that often so I don't know if they're doing Twitter questions for this tour but let me know in the comments below if you know if they're doing Twitter questions for this tour because I would love for one of mine to be answered that would be super amazing and like that would be the most memorable moment of the night so yeah if they're doing that then I really want that to happen so let me know in the comments if you know if that is happening because I have not been up to date on my Twitter lately since I've been working